Hi, I'm going to spend a couple of minutes now talking about what we can do to help you to stop comfort eating. Now, comfort eating is a term that's used to describe, um, well, it's a, it's a wide ranging term. It can range from someone who has a cake in the afternoon to feel comfortable um, and to just relax and go, oh, it's time for my treat, you know, time for my, time for me, time for something for me. Ah, that's better to the person who comfort eats pretty much 24 hours a day. Um, so it's really a it's really a question of how we define the term, but what we do applies equally to any kind of com of comfort eating. What we do is train the person to be comfortable eating appropriately. Now, comfort eating is a pattern. It's a learned sequence of thinking and feeling that people inadvertently get into. They find themselves doing the same thing day after day after day eating when they don't really need to, eating out of habit. What people will describe as comfort eating very often isn't actually that comfortable for them. Um, they don't feel that comfortable eating it, the food and they don't feel that comfortable afterwards. But when asked, you know, what is your eating problem? They'll say, oh, it's, it's comfort eating. So I don't care what you call it. Eating too much of the wrong food, whether it makes you comfortable or uncomfortable, is something you can change. Now, this isn't a therapeutic kind of intervention. This is more education, but it isn't us telling you what to do because you probably know what to do. You've probably read books. Maybe you've seen a nutritionist. What this is, is directly educating. So training might be a bit better. Training your mind so that you are more under control. We ain't nutritionists. We're not going to tell you what to eat. We are going to help you to more easily get a balanced diet and eat well and eat and stop eating when you're not hungry anymore. The other side of comfort eating, if you like, is those people who actually need more comfort in their lives, who need to feel better about themselves generally. So NLP and hypnosis are spectacular at this. With using the techniques that we use, um, we can help you to aim yourself at feeling more, not just simply more comfortable, but significantly better about yourself. Think about how you want to be when you're not comfort eating anymore. It's the direction of your consciousness will take you wherever you point at. In other words, when you aim yourself at feeling wonderful, then you can get there. Now that might seem to be a bit of a big step for some of you that are going, well, I just feel like shit. And the only thing I get out of life is at least I can eat these 12 donuts. Now I may sound like I'm being facetious. I take you seriously, but I don't necessarily take the problem seriously. I'm interested in where you're going, how to get your mind to aim at eating appropriately, at eating healthy food, eating a balanced kind of diet. Using NLP and hypnosis, I can get you there. And it isn't just me. Any of my colleagues can do this for you. We can help you to eat appropriately and bring more comfort into your life in general. So give us a call.